Thank you for joining this short webinar showing you how to access the Secure File Upload Service on the Customs Declaration Service. Throughout this walkthrough, we'll be showing you screenshots from the Customs Declaration Service and Gov.uk. Please note that HMRC is constantly improving the digital experience of our customers, so you may find that over time, some of these screenshots will be slightly different to those you'll see in the Customs Declaration Service. Additionally, please note that throughout this video, we will be using dummy data. Before you start, you'll need to subscribe to the Customs Declaration Service. If you haven't already, you can subscribe by following the easy step-by-step -step guidance on gov.uk. Or you can also watch our short video, How to Subscribe to the Customs Declaration Service. You'll also need your Government Gateway user ID and password, your Economic Operators Registration and Identification or EORI number. The Movement Reference Number, also known as the MRN, you get when you submit a declaration. The Digital Secure File Upload Service has been delivered by HMRC to remove the need for the manual processing of supporting documentation for declarations. This means that you no longer need to email to provide supporting documentation. You will only need to provide supporting documentation when requested to do so by Customs. Supporting documents include, for example, any licences or certificates, evidence of the goods value, a packing list of the items included, proof of origin certificates. Let's start your secure file uploading journey. Firstly, you need to go to gov.uk and search for upload documents and get messages. Select the link and you'll get to the landing page. Scroll down the page and select Start Now. Enter your Government Gateway user ID and password, then select Sign In. Here you'll be given the option to select either View Messages about your declarations, Attach Documents to a Declaration. In this scenario, select Attach Documents to a Declaration and then continue. You'll then be prompted to input your Movement Reference Number or MRN from the declaration you want to attach the file to. The MRN number is unique 18 character reference number created each time a customs declaration is submitted linking those goods to you. Enter your MRN and select continue. Next, you'll be asked to enter your contact details as follows. Your name, company name, phone number, and email address. Once you have filled in your contact details, you'll be asked to specify the number of files you want to upload. You can submit a maximum of 10 files. You're able to upload multiple documents as a single file as long as the size of the file doesn't exceed the maximum of 10 megabytes. Acceptable formats are JPEG, PNG, also known as PING, TXT, also known as text, and PDF. Word or Excel files are not accepted as they are more prone to malware and viruses when uploading. You should save your Word and Excel documents as a PDF before uploading. 
you can save them as a PDF by clicking the drop down and selecting PDF. Enter the number of files you wish to upload and continue. To begin uploading your first file, select Upload and Continue. You'll be presented with this screen until the number of documents dated have been uploaded. Select Choose File and locate the file you want to upload. The following confirmation screen shows that you have successfully uploaded your file. This screen can be saved or printed. However, please note there is currently no email confirmation. As long as you've provided the relevant documents, Customs can then clear your goods accordingly. For further information, please go to gov.uk. We hope you found this useful. Thank you for watching.